this game was not on Bowser's radar. One day, a friend on Discord said about playing it while we were hanging out, waiting for a game showcase to happen. Three of us played while in voice chat together for hours trying to beat each other's times. We missed the game showcase because we were having too much fun. Oh, nice. All right, I'm excited to try it. Hey, LV, what's going on? In 2091, a giant disk is discovered in orbit of Jupiter. Jupiter, a crew of international scientists is sent to investigate. Yes, that's me. They crawl through a hole. What is this? Oh, okay. Use the left stick to move. Yeah. Oh. Oh, 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 what, what, what am I, what is happening? I don't even know what I'm doing. Oh, that's, that hurt. Okay. Hey, it's got Bowser's ranking up there. All right, so what do I, what am I doing? Die from four disc types? Survive five seconds. I did that. Okay. <laughs> you walked in and just saw my entrails all over the floor. Yeah, and you're like, why? So why did I beat five that? Seconds? So did I beat that level? Or do I have to? I have to die from four disc types. You survive so long, uh, so long enough, so more rooms are open. Okay, cool. Here we go. Thank you. Survive ten seconds. Okay. Oh God. And then you can compare your friend's scores with your score. Oh uh, yeah. Oh. Nah. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, Eighteen I... seconds. All right. Bowser survived twenty-eight seconds on that level. Let's do that. Twenty-eight. I can see how this would quickly become competition with your friends oh that was better but not as good bowser op please nerf the four disc types is an objective you'll get along the way yeah 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 i'm gonna try one more time to beat you on this one Now I know why they call it disc room. Because it's a room with discs in it. I call it the disc room. I am so dead. <laughs> okay, let's go on to the next one. Bowser, I cannot beat you. All right, so this one is survive 10 seconds. Okay. Oh! <laughs> I thought by standing right there, I was going to be okay. <laughs> but no. But no, that was not okay. New ability, dash. Hold A to dash through discs. Okay. Now I wonder if I can go here and do better. You can go through a disc? Oh, you can go through. All right, nice. No, I did worse. I did worse with the new ability. Okay. Uh, survive 10 seconds here. <sighs> oh, okay. Well, we got it. 12 seconds. Deer in headlights, Bog is the ch in the chainsaw. Yeah, exactly. Okay, these are big and slow moving. Oh, 
Just stand there, Bog. Just stand there. Mm hmm. Can I change the button? even touching that wait what the hell did i just do oh, hold on maybe unplugging replugging i messed it all up We were having so much fun until I went in there. Uh. It's like joystick drift to you. It's my PS5 controller. Um. But it happened when I changed the setting. And I can't change that setting back. Maybe I can do it with keyboard and mouse. That's not a juicy. Settings. Select X. Control X. Thumbstick left. Right, let me try that again. I just won't change the controls. There we go. There's a golden one. seconds all right oops move on to the next one all right let's go this way survive five seconds and survive 90 seconds total in this zone okay five seconds like this 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 like this like works out your brain all right 31 seconds all right nice let's go right survive 10 seconds survive zero seconds or less wait how do i survive zero seconds or less <laughs> the first place I noticed your stick messing up was in the menus that made them impossible. It, I, it wasn't it wasn't my controller having issues. It was I literally accidentally set some setting to change which stick was doing what and that made it go all wonky. I don't know why. Yeah. Make sure you don't leave a room until you've beaten all Bowser's times. Uh, I don't think I want to do that.
I love how simple it is, you know? The premise. It's like dodgeball the game. Whoa! Okay. All right. Die from 15 disc types. Survived 90 seconds total in the zone. We did that, right? There's nothing specific to do in this game, in this room. smashed Joe was one of the folks you played this with oh there we go hey Joel what's going on oh I was so close to beating Bowser this is a hard one seconds it's almost four you got 14 seconds in this how no way oh wow this is really hard bowser has the ultimate brag rights on this beat the final boss on the first try oh really there's bosses? I just gotta... I, it seems like 13 seconds is so doable, but it's really not. All right! Dang it, now I want to play this again now. <laughs> That's what happens, right? <laughs> happens every time. All right, defeat the gatekeeper. And, and how would one do that? Just picking up goodies. in the last little pellet. Damn. You're gonna have to go back and beat Fox times now? Never! Except probably. the magic grapefruit inside the grapefruit there was a guy with a duffel bag i put the grapefruit in my butt oh there's the map look at the map so what is okay white survive 20 seconds is okay all right locked room all right let's go see what this is 
Might have to get this for your deck, Pinky Bell. Uh, I'm already having a great time with it. And I can totally see, like, your friend's scores being up there. How they would taunt you, you know? in the circle or it doesn't count. seconds. I Bowser's gonna hate that one. 19.8 versus 19.4. Alright, let's go to the carousel. And you thought you were being a troll with this pick? Of course you were! We can still have fun and be a troll game. There's a lot of... There's a lot of uh, intensely... Intensely difficult games that I really enjoy. To be honest though, I did think it was going to be like a... Uh, a Meat Boy type of game. where it just gets like beyond my capabilities very quickly. <laughs> I can see Evil Twin Link playing this. Bowser and I had another friend play this all on voice chat for like four to five hours straight on a Saturday a while back. It was a great time. I can imagine. Did you guys like go to the next rooms like all together? Like, all right, let's go do this room now. My best. I could be 14. Hey, Cuddly Shark, what's going on? Whoa, those have a slow aura. Oh, they juked me. All right. Where we go? Survive 20 seconds. Oh. Current location. Okay. What do I need to do? I have to... Do I do this one? Yeah. This is that impossible one. Uh, how do I unlock these other rooms, though? Survive zero seconds or less. You just popping in for a work lurk? Well, it's good to see you. And not synchronized like that, but I think we all started within 20, 30 minutes of each other. Okay, gotcha. Uh, so how do I unlock other rooms? Do I have to, like, just do better in these? Like, here's the starting room, right? Is this the first room? Maybe try to get 20 seconds here. How 
come 20 seconds seems so long in a situation like this? It's like impossibly long. Oh, I was gonna die. I was gonna cry if it wasn't 20 there. All right, we got that. Unlock two different abilities. Survive for zero seconds or less. It has to be done in this room. Wait. This one. Okay. Hey. Hey. How do you survive zero seconds or less? Might need another ability to do that. Okay, so and how do I do something like this? Unlock two different abilities. How would I go about doing that? first 30 seconds. Thirty-four seconds. Nice. I need to die to a certain disc to get the next ability. All right. Thank you. There we go. <laughs> Slow. Do you only get one ability? Slow. That's pretty interesting. Okay, now I can see how we can get the, the zero second death. In fact, I don't even need to do this level. I need to do the one with this, the zero second. But the buttons are wrong too. All right, hold on, hold the phone. Everybody relax. go. It doesn't count? That was zero seconds? That's not zero seconds. Point four. zero nice okay um that opened up this room stay sharp
Holy guacamole. Yeah, that was guacamole. Okay. Die from 15 disc types. We got this room now. Survive five seconds. Defeat two gatekeepers, survive five seconds in all unlocked rooms. Survive 60 seconds total in this zone, which we've already done. You wonder if there's a reverse time button? I don't know. So far, I only have two abilities. Okay. Out of the middle, that's cheating. Considered a gatekeeper. We opened the door, and a guy was putting the finishing touches on the bomb in his duffel bag. What? Huh? Oh! Zip and run. Can I go chase him? Hey, Sango, what's going on? Felt like I was Neo in the Matrix there. I'm not gonna lie. Is that Logan? That's pretty good. I'm good with 16 on that one. <laughs> just came right for me. Oh. 
Okay, we're out. Two, ten seconds here. Try dash. Oh, we got the pit of Sarlacc. New ability, clone. Clone yourself. How does that work? And if any of them are alive, we're still in it? <laughs> what? The clone is so weird. I can be my own best friend and I can send myself for pizza, so I say. Is this a boss? Survive 10 seconds rooms. This is a boss though, right? I, have to... I don't see hit the health counting down like the other guy. There's one, two. The clone ability is really weird. I didn't even see that one. Time goes down 0.5 the longer you take to grab the pellet looks like but each one only has one second added think it's yeah, i'm not i i have no idea what the ui is trying to tell me on this level like it starts at zero time why would it say time that gives me one why would it be labeled as time i don't know All I know is I need to collect these pellets. 
That's all I need to know. I can't get that one. for so long there i think it's just time instead of hit points so they don't have to modify the ui yeah, but it's not even hit points it starts at zero like how do i know what i need to get to is it just 10 i guess 10 seconds i have to do 10 of them i've gotten a nine five six seven eight This one's really hard. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm gonna try slow down time. Four, five, what happened there. I was like, what? <laughs> I was like, why is it still going? <laughs> uh, all right. So what else we need to do? I feel like I skipped stuff. Oh, you got a meeting time hopefully back soon. I hope you can come back soon too. I hope it goes okay. Um, yeah. So I don't know what happens in that room. That's a weird room. Survive 20 seconds here. Ability absorb? Hold A to absorb a disc. Okay. I don't think I absorbed it wet, right? I have no idea how that board works. Oh. really weird.
I got the 20. Okay. Try clone again. Survive 30 seconds. Uh. That zone seems hard overall. There's a lot of us. We're all gonna die. Oh no. <laughs> that was so bad. 22 seconds though. I don't feel like this is the right ability. I feel like dash maybe for this one. If the lights would stop blinking, this would be so much better. Please don't blink, lights. Did I get 30? Oh, nice. 36. Bowser got a minute and six seconds on this one? You lose one second every time you make a clone? Really? Oh, well, that's not worth it then. I also, that's also the reason why the slow time one's a little weird, you know? Oh, I didn't want to do this one again. Die with over four discs in the room? survive 20 seconds in 12 rooms. No, don't end my run. Oh, yeah, yeah. End my run. That's fine. Why am I getting zero? Curious. Maybe if the wait for it for it is to show up before the timer starts. Surely it couldn't be that long, right? You have to clone? Yeah, I don't know. Now there's three discs. Joel, can you hit? Give me a hit.
<laughs> you need to re-google it. Oh, no worries. <laughs> I, I wonder if it's a certain power you need to have. So I can get a, I can get three. I don't know how to make a fourth one. So I go like that and I die, and then there's two, and then I make a fourth, a third. I mean. I don't understand why the timer doesn't go on this one. Yeah, I'm just gonna swap. Uh... This one's new. Apparently you need to go to a certain room first. Okay, so it's a weird solution that honestly, I can't really think of any helpful hint just providing you a link to the YouTube video. Ah, okay. No worries. So I need to go to a different room first. me out. Hey, but we got him. Try this one again. Eleven is my new best. The link from Roosevelt looks like it does the trick if you want to look at it later. Okay. Yeah, thank you. I'll just skip that room for now. All right, survive 10 seconds. Feed for what? Feed for what? state that this puts my brain in in like literally just ultimate concentration mode oh i need one more Yeah, 
damn, I keep getting nine. I think slow down time is probably best. Two, three, oh, I got greedy. One, two, three, four. Five, six, death. Damn, this is really hard. Use dash almost exclusively throughout the game, but others used all of the different ones. Yeah, I, uh, yeah, I, like, like some of them, dash and slow time seem to be my favorite so far. I got it? Okay, good. Now, I don't know what feed four is. I feed, I fed one of four. Maybe, is that dying to the mouth? No. Get something else to be on the mouth? And after 19 months, the hero returned and there was much rejoicing. Yay! Yay. Thank you so much, Glacial Sin, for the resub rummy. I hope you're having a nice Friday. And thanks again for your support. This is Disc Room, by the way, anybody that's just tuning in. It's on uh, Game Pass. And you can type hashtag game for the humble link if you want to own the game. Wow, we got 19 there. That's pretty good. I don't think we're gonna do better than that. I don't know how to get the feed the four or four though, but we'll figure that out at some point. All right, defeat all four different antibodies in a row. Collect 50 orbs total in this zone. different antibodies in a row. Spawn right on my face. Fifty orbs total. I already did that. Oh damn! 
54 life? Do you think slow down or dash for this one? I think the antibodies are in neighboring rooms, so essentially it's completing them all without dying if I recall. What it's like what's an antibody? Like the, the mini bosses? Yeah. Scott says, is there a plot for this game or is there just crazy bullet hell game? You uh There was there was a cutscene in the beginning. Yeah. You only choose one ability, yeah, you can swap it. There's a tiny bit of story, Scott, but mostly crazy bullet hell game. I think the most compelling thing is definitely your friends will show up there with their scores on each board. Your friends on Xbox. I wish I could see the score while I'm playing. I know it's on the screen, but I can't look. I can't like glance. All right. Oh, I'm dead. I don't know what I'm thinking. I'm just going right toward the bad guy. Sorry, lack monster killed me. Two more? Are you kidding me? How much health? Oh no, I needed 12 more. Oh, he's got 60 health. I thought he had 50. Sometimes the pattern just has to go your way too, you know? That butt. Like there's nothing I can do there. 
This is really hard. All right, let's do a different level. Uh, let's try this one. I hate this level. There's much crap on the screen. There's definitely some RNG. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Survive 30 seconds. That was good. Just spawned on me. done i think so survive 10 seconds perfect dark i literally have to survive 10 seconds here Your day going gang i'm gonna try to get 10 seconds on this level how maybe clones here maybe Clones definitely take time away. Using slow or something doesn't work. Why, while you slow time, it, time doesn't go. Try slow time, but this is what's gonna happen here. Oh, we can actually see at least. Oh. Okay, so yeah, now I know there's one that's going around the outside. Five seconds is my best. That's my best, 5.4. Need to see eight seconds. did it we did it nice okay i never have to do that board again
I like this level. Over a minute. Woo! I beat the dev team? That was my first time, probably my only time doing that one. Wow. Okay. Never have to do that one again. Phantom Gatekeeper. Oh, it's a boss. These pellets need to show up quicker. It did come out of nowhere. It had my number, Rosewolf. Balls. So many of the dead team times in other rooms doesn't make sense. They hack. Well, I wonder if they, they had like literally just a contest in their dev team, like whoever on our dev team does the best score on this when we ship the game. That's the score that it'll go out as. Oh. I hate this whole zone with the visibility issue. So tough. Two more. One more. We got some story for whoever was asking. Was that Scott was asking? Story. All right, inside the ball, there was a woman waking up next to a cryo sleep bed. She dons a suit. She yells from her 
trapped behind the door. Don't you leave me here? And she goes, watch me leave. And she climbs up the ladder with her big ass gloves. She holds the orb while the flames rain down and puts the orb in her butt. See, there's a story. The game you made for your college capstone was a bullet hell. I found most of my levels super easy. Even when we did play testing, people got destroyed. <laughs> yeah, when you make it yourself, you know it like the back of your hand. All right, hold on. Um, Let's go here. Ponza dot. What what is the goal here? Just die from forty five different types. There's no other goal. Okay, so I guess we don't need to do that one. The butt orbs got me. The butt orbs always get me. Survive for two minutes? Oh, in... Timer's not running at all. Okay, I have no idea. Oh, I did this one already. Four different gatekeepers. Undefeated gatekeeper. I have all of those unlocked. Undiscovered disc. So these are the ones where I have an undiscovered disc. What more do I have to do in some of these? Wow, this is not going well. I got smeared all over the place. Why you dance? She starts dancing, distracts me. No dancing. I'm gonna blame you. I guess I stuck on ten. Uh, okay. 
Survive five seconds and all unlock rooms. Where are the rooms that I haven't done for five seconds? Discs. Rooms have some kind of defense system. These discs are everywhere. Discs on the walls. It seems these rooms and doors respond to my every death. I'm being forced to temper running for my life with constant observation and anticipation. If only there was more time. It's as though this disc just altered me on a molecular level. I can now phase my existence in and out of its physical form. Why do these form rooms prescribe my survival? I'm starting to feel more like a test subject than an intruder. Why do these rooms keep bringing me back to life? It is a gift. A gift to the friends of the otters. Glacial Sin, thank you so much for getting a sub to rub it. That's our first newer gift sub of the day. Four more. We'll do a Spark Vault Game Vault combo giveaway. I think the perpetual death is beginning to get to me. All these rooms and discs are bleeding together. This monstrous disc seemed to be a gatekeeper of some sort, and its purpose distinctly tied to the golden orbs. Okay. I find myself no longer observing each disc, simply running from them. The very discs that slow me down have given me power to dampen time. Its effect is brief, but could bring me closer to these discs. Movement in irregular patterns. The presence of foliage puzzles me. The presence of foliage puzzles me. How can anything grow in this harsh environment? I'm now convinced there is a connection between these discs and my deaths. Not only do they differentiate in purpose, they almost seem to differ in personality. These discs are not inanimate. They are entities. My dying seems to speak their language. I was wrong. There is no positive regard for my survival, simply imminent death, abstracted by intervals. The more alive the disc, the more I die. I now seem to run from even cognition. Discovery has become suffering. I am prey in a predator place. This vile disc has foregone its foliage for flesh and bone. It is it mocking us? The fate of my friend no longer fuels me. I feel an almost animal instinct to become more disc-like in my desperation. Sometimes I feel like I'm feeding myself to this ravenous disc, immortal food for perpetual digestion. This disc gave me the ability to clone myself, seemingly infinitely. We're growing increasingly unsure if these abilities are meant to preserve our lives or mock them. Why... Why more golden orbs? Why now? Why do I have to continue to study that which only dissects me? I feel more watched than before. I no longer notice the metal of deaths. Just a burning brush against my bones as the seconds connect endlessly. These rooms reek of rot and burning blood and bloated body. It's like these discs can smell my fear. I have never felt hate like I do for some of these more malevolent discs, yet there is something magnificent to their perfect violence. Each gatekeeper grows more brutal in their presence. I am reduced to firing nerves and molten instinct. I wonder if we are the only species this disc has ever had its weirding way with. Just when I thought I'd seen it all. I feel further from the safety of science than ever. This darkness has overdriven my every nerve. I am alive with fear alone. These rooms reek of rotten burning. Oh, I did. Oh, wait, I skipped up. I'm afraid of no ghosts, yet these discs haunt me. This disc has become part of me. The hurricane of pain that came with containing itself my, myself means nothing. Despite the horror of every second, I long to be hugged. Another gatekeeper I can barely remember being under sky. This golden disc seems familiar, almost allegorical. The lack of aggression, the warmth in, its room, in this room perplexes me. All right. So there's all the lore we got from the discs we've collected. This is not a nice bedtime story. Sorry. Is it bedtime? I know this does seem pretty dark. Um, I don't know how to lock unlock some of these rooms. Survive 120 seconds. Is it here? Oh, I can't select that. Just survive 120 seconds in any room. Oh, 
Well, the dev team only got 58 here. Yeah, um... It says survive 120 seconds. Oh, adjacent rooms... Total? Yeah, we have best time is 20 down here. Oh, this is the one. Oh, yeah, but we don't... There's, there's nothing happens here. with over four discs in this room. I don't know how to do that. Clone and step into the two symbols? Okay. I'll buy that for a dollar. Oh, look. Okay, we can use the time. down to zero. Oh. All right, there we go. Together we can stop one of these saws, don't you think? <sighs> Maybe not. Okay, so that's not it. I don't know. Beat all four different antibodies in a row. Brutal antibody. Survive five seconds in all unlocked rooms. There's two more. How are you supposed to tell, though, which ones you've done it on and which ones you haven't? Die with over four discs in the room. I don't know how to do that. Die with 45 different disc types. I still need 12 more of those. Survive five seconds in all unlocked rooms. There's two more of those. I don't know which rooms that would be. Defeat four different gatekeepers. I don't see any of them unlocked. Except this one. And this one we don't know how to do. Oh, wait. I did... Did I do this one? I thought I did this one. Why does it say... Uh... Why does it say undefeated gatekeeper? I thought I did this one.
Nowhere to go. I thought I beat this one. I really do. Maybe I gave up though. Sometimes you just can't do anything. See? It's coming right for us. I just kind of feel screwed. This guy's no joke. Probably second hardest room in the game in your opinion. I thought I, I really thought I beat it, but I guess I gave up and moved on. All right, let's try to beat this guy. We can do it. Let's go waters. Got some achievement there. Oh, uh, we were talking about RNG. I moved on to another room. Okay. right on me no sphincters allowed oh god ah! my god I need four more just four And the pit of Sarlacc at me. So in these types of maps, does cloning add time? I don't think so. Uh, cloning, cl cloning, cloning is weird. Okay, it, it might not translate if you're uh, just by watching. So I clone people. Let's say I clone four people. All right. Now I'm watching this guy. And there's three clones and they're all moving in sync with my actions now if my guy dies suddenly like i have to shift focus and try to find another guy to control and like i wind up dying so 
<laughs> it's very hard to like take advantage of the fact that you have extra lives because if if you die you literally have to shift focus real quick somewhere else and, and take over hold on let's just start over start over I can see the temptation to be like, oh, well, the clone gives you extra guys. That's like extra lives. So you survive more. But being able to slow down the time or dash seems much better overall. I'm not. Yes, I am. Damn it! There's sometimes just nowhere to go. Watching this game gives you a mild amounts of stress. Try playing it. Actually, play, playing it is uh, actually a lot of fun. And like I said, it gets you into uh, kind of like a state of flow almost. I can see how watching it, though, would be more stressful because... I'm making split-second decisions that are probably different than the split-second decisions you would make. And you're kind of like, hey, but no, no, why would you do that? You know? Do like that. I mean, still, I'd still die, but I don't know how I got out of there. Joel says, having already beat this game, I am not stressed at, at all watching you compared to when I played. <laughs> Techno News trying to figure out how a big brain saw is growling. Good point. Power of the mind. Joel, do you remember if you beat this guy with uh, freeze time or dash? I feel like dash would be good, but I, I feel like freeze time gets me out of things like that, you know? Almost surely it was dash. Okay.
I hate that. I keep like getting too close to him for no partic no particular reason. Because I'm greedy and I want all the pellets. Give me those power pellets. Starts like that. As soon as I started going up there, I was already smacking myself in my brain. In my brain, I'm like, don't do that. Don't go up there. Why are you going up there? Don't go up there. You fool. Only fools would do that. And I did it anyway. I'm very vulnerable right now. Very vulnerable. Oh, this is going to be a mess. Oh, I saw the butt coming in down there. How often can you slow down time? I can slow down time often, but it, it's got a charge, right? So you'll see the slowdown, it starts off really big. And it starts to suck in like this. And the longer I hold it, it goes away. And then I have none. So as long as I go, as long as I let it recharge, I can kind of go like this. I can activate it. It starts going in and then it'll grow. And act, like I can constantly activate it. But once I run out of energy, it's gone. Um, and I have to let it regrow again. So I try not to let it taper off. The other thing is you cannot grab the balls while you're slowing down time. Science experiment. Can you can you collect a pellet if you dash through it? No. I mean, I'll try. I'll try the dash though. We'll see. Dashing might be good. Placement of the balls for this run have been really good. It's all about ball placement. It is. I only needed five more there. I mean, the dash allows you to basically like just run into stuff. <laughs> you know, it's like, all right, uh, it's like I'm screwed here, so I'm just gonna run through everything. So maybe dash is best. the best yet three more
Maybe dash is better. Yeah, I'm feeling I'm feeling better with dash. Only 35 more pellets to go. Only 29. Balls. Hey, Gamer Knight, what's up? mistake so was that it feels like the discs are all in voice chat together coordinating their attack totally true i feel like i can't end the stream till we beat this one room more <laughs> stop looking at the stupid score <laughs> this is like my white whale now discs and sphincters i'm gonna see it in my dreams Discs and sphincters, discs and sphincters. There's not much that gonna rhyme with sphincters. This I'll tell you, brother. Hey, Bowser. Welcome back. This room is killing my soul. Bowser lost a couple years of life expectancy on this very room. This one killed your soul as well. Well, the problem is I've gotten super close like five times. I was within five balls like five times. I'm stuck in the corner and like I'm trying to dodge all the stupid buzz saws and I'm like all right I'm waiting for my moment to get out of here and then it's just like sphincter right on me 
Sphincter right on me. Suddenly Sphincter! Standing beside me! For some reason, having pink blood seemed less gory than red. Interesting that you say that. You can change the color of the blood. Oh, you can have confetti blood? Let's do that. What does that look like? Oh, little confetti bits. There you go. Clown blood, indeed. Hey, just beat this one? All right, just because you said that. I wasn't trying till now. Now I'll do it. I'm not allowed to leave and start my week until we beat this. This level's holding my uh, my weekend hostage. And I love it. I'm determined. Only 24 more pellets stand between me and my weekend. 21. 18. Sphincter come out of nowhere saying stream more. Oh my god. It's a surprise, Bogathon. Surprise! I'll just get Logan to come down here and do it. This young brain.
I got sphincters to the left of me. Sphincters to the right. Stuck in the middle with you. supposed to be dead there. Oh boy. Have I found myself not as easily being able to play certain game genres? when you were younger. That's a very difficult question to answer. Um, I mean, I'm sure my reflexes have slowed down, you know, as I've aged, as it's normal to have happened. I'm sure that's happened, but um, it's tough to know because as a kid, I felt like I was super good at video games. Like, my local group of friends who would come over to my house and stuff like I feel like I was besides maybe my brother I like I might have been the best in like our neighborhood and stuff but that's such a small sample and like even even like playing um games like Street Fighter in the arcades and Soul Calibur in the arcades I felt like I was always able to hold my own when I was younger and stuff but I didn't have the internet to compare it to right when the internet came out and competitive games and games where you can compare yourself to others like on a more global scale then I realized where the pecking order truly was <laughs> and uh so I, I I don't know if that's a sign of me you know and then I also feel like I've since I've been your streamer I have played harder games and games that require way more coordination just as a as a as a result of me streaming full-time and you know, doing all different types of content. Um, so I've played more difficult games and beaten more difficult games as I've aged than I did when I was younger, you know? Like, for example, like this. <laughs> like, I don't know if I would have played this as a kid, but like, I can see how it's entertaining to watch, you know, here on Twitch. Same thing with like a Dark Souls type game. There's, I never, I never played any of the Dark Souls games. I just thought it wasn't for me. Kind of stuff. I don't know. I don't know how to answer that question. I'm sure it has an impact, but I don't notice like, oh, well, I can't play Street Fighter anymore. Or I can't play those type of games anymore. I don't know. What about you guys? Interesting question, though. I love how this is hard, but as soon as I die, like I can get right back into it. One bush and button push. That's so key in these type of experiences for me. It's like, just let me get me right back into the next attempt, you know? No delay, let's just go. Like if, it ha if I had to wait for a you died message and then waited for it to fade to black and then fade back in, like I would, I would be done, you know? Let's get me back in immediately. Bad move. Joel says, not sure about others, but for me personally as a kid, I played way fewer games but longer hours compared to as an adult. Again, it's skewed because I do this for my job, but I, I definitely played way fewer games. There were There were fewer games that I was interested in like, we've talked about this on stream a whole bunch. Like, 
as a kid, there could be... As a kid, there could be uh, months before a game in a genre I was interested in, like, would would come out. Like, now there's a game in the genres that I'm interested in coming out, like, multiple times every week. <laughs> there's just so many more games. There's nowhere to go. Now, go back to Techno Nude's question. There are definitely my arms, my wrists, my fingers, my thumb, uh, all of that. I've in, uh, like I've had a couple injuries in those areas from how much gaming I do, and so yeah, that has certainly had an impact as I've gotten older. what I just did there. No. You're thir only 36, but notice I have trouble keeping track of multiple things at once compared to my 20s. Could be my eyesight just getting worse, though. Like, Guild Wars 2 curse add-on that made it bigger was a huge improvement for me. UI stuff being big enough. Yeah, that... Certainly, eyesight is, is an issue for me as well. Your brother and you only got a new game once or twice a year. We played the living heck out of the ones we did. Oh, oh yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yeah, Gardner Girl's right. Pong kept you busy for hours. Yeah, we'd get a game and you literally saw like everything the game had to offer within like 30 minutes of playing it. But then that you knew that was the game you were going to play for the next month or two. You know, every morning was a fresh start. You would reset, like, the, the games. Like, all right, let's play a little bit of this until I'm sick of dying on that. Now let's go to this game. We would rotate the games, th you know, in the Atari. This game is, this level is so easy, uh, so uh, evil. Not easy at all. I have to beat this, though. This is killing me. It's easy evil. I gotta get a Zarya down here. Zarya, you gotta come beat this. Boss's health is on the left, 26, right? Grab pellets to do damage to him. All right. And all you have is run around and you have one button is the dash. You're invulnerable during the dash. And I just think you just have to do collect 50 pellets before you die. There you go. It's this button for dash. No, don't, don't do that again. No, no, no. This one. Only that button. <laughs> you can just go right back into it with that button. Oh. So there you go. You did 21 points that time. Oh, it's not. It's not 50. It's 60, right? 60. Sorry. 60. That was wrong. That was so wrong. You're a third of the way there. Woo! I am not good at this game. How do people play this game? Why does the pellets look like poop? You mean, why does the monster coming out of the ground look like a butthole? Yes. Yeah. What? That's a sphincter. That's why I've been singing sphincter songs. Have you heard me? Yes. You can go through it while you dash. That was 35 damage. I was over halfway there. How far have you gotten? 57 out of 60. 
Really? Oh yeah. Is that a spiky brain? I believe it is, Sodder's Gotch. I believe it is. That's a butthole. I knew it was a butthole. I can't do this. How do you do that? <laughs> well, I haven't yet. <laughs> but I told the stream I can't end until I beat it. And you know, anything you say on stream has to happen. You know? I also can't end the stream without, you know, 10 more gifted subs. This won't happen. Can't happen. Sphincter! Ooh, that was a good one. Oh! My weekend rests on you grabbing all those balls. That, that's every weekend, Glacial Sin. <laughs> I just spit on my... <laughs> I just spit on my keyboard. Rustica. Thank you, Gardner girl. Scaring the crap out of me. Thank you very much. Oh! I thought that was it, gang. I thought we had it that time. That last attempt, I purposely didn't look at how much life was left because I'm like, you know, it's not worth it. Just play. And that's what I did. I tried and then ultimately came up short. What? Everybody in the grandma was in that corner. I'm sorry, you got 57 much faster. I'm just saying this is me. She left. This is, I, that was me. Yes, T-Rex. Would you like me to try again? And now you're gonna get, see, now I'm just, now, like when I finally do it, like they're gonna think it was you. That's my big fear now. She comes in like a T-Rex. You wanna sit? No. Hi -ya. The hitbox seems fairly forgiving on the, the big guy. Yeah, well you also have to, if we're dashing, if you see the, like the little rainbow trails behind us, you're, we're invulnerable. We're invulnerable. During that, you have iframes on the dodge. Ay, 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 ay. I was 36. I'll go like this so everyone knows when it's me and where it's you.
It's addicting, isn't it? The fact that you can go right back in like two seconds later. instant. Oh, okay. You can't grab pellets while dashing. Imagine this in multiplayer. Yeah. The cool thing is this is the kind of multiplayer they have. You can compare your score to your friends. Watching the big butthole one Saturday morning. Oh, don't come towards me. Come on, how's that bullshit? Go up. Why is it watching me? All right, back to me. <laughs> I'm finally gonna do it. They're like, Azaria did it. All right, that's it. I want to start my weekend. Here we go. Yikes. He's chasing me. Oh, come on. Why'd you come to my corner? Nice quote, Rosewell. Come to my corner. Crawl inside. Wait by the light of the moon. This is spicy. How can there still be 14 more? 11 more. No! How is 55? We can do this, Kang. Because I believe in crystal light. I'm just gonna die because I didn't even get one. Roswell, take care. Have a great weekend and have a wonderful time next week. I did get back from the meeting, yeah.
this game looks like pain to you or even like this is so you like i think you would enjoy this a lot Mr. I play Hades on hell mode. Just for the challenge. Nowhere to go, nowhere to go. Marauder, can't you see like Wheezy and Evil Twin Link? Like playing this side by side, watching the different scores. Who just beat whose score in which room? I can see it. Gotten one. Maybe they're not gonna have to give up. I don't want to give up. I want to beat it. Joel says we need a sphincter death count on the side. No one in the history of the human race has ever said that phrase before. You are the first. Sometimes there's just nowhere to go. Ooh, that was a nice run right there. like a big bird on a nest with the eggs in the thing yeah they just camped it i can't believe they camped it and there's no extra balls it's like exact they give you the exact number to kill it and that's it you have to collect every one of them I was expecting there to be like another one show up somewhere. But no. See, I'm already not feeling this one for some reason. I'm still gonna try. All right, it's looking better. That was, that was a nice little run there. I can't get anywhere near the walls though.
so 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 hard This is the one you believe, Joel? All right, this is the one right here. This one right here. Next one. <laughs> like what? Like, come on. They're just sitting on them. There we go, baby. There we go. Thank God. Oh my God. Great job. Thank you. Thank you, whoever that was. Oh. All right, we got the story. Inside the bowl, there was a pod and a small hand coming up from the pod. The hand grabbed the hand of the other hand, and the hand, shh, she said, as she walked onto the ship. And this guy had the ball, and there was purple stuff everywhere. The end. Oh. Yay! New best. No, I'm not doing that ever in my life uh, ever again. Not ever doing that level again. Ever. That was a lot of fun. It was also very hard, thanks to Bowser. Oh, I didn't know this was a Devolver digital game. How interesting. Um, thanks to Bowser for suggesting I try this. It is difficult. It is challenging. But it also, surprisingly, fun and addicting. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream today. 